deserves not just a good nominee, but the best person for the job. And the person that we saw come before us yesterday was filled with such rancor and animus, such a anger, that I cannot accept that he would be an impartial and objective justice on the United States Supreme Court. To describe members of this committee as a left-wing conspiracy, to threaten, literally to threaten United States Senator, I simply cannot accept. We are interviewing, or we were, Judge Kavanaugh for a position that is a lifetime appointment to the highest court in the land. He cannot be removed except through impeachment, <coughs> and he will be there for decades to come. I made no secret of my opposition to him based on his out of the mainstream views and judicial philosophy, his apparent goal to chip away, if not overturn Roe v. Wade and the guarantees that allow women to decide when and whether they become pregnant and have children, the decision by millions of Americans to marry the person they love, consumer rights, workers' rights, the powers of the president, which I think would become an imperial presidency if he becomes a justice on the Supreme Court. But yesterday, my opposition solidified because of temperament and fitness, which I believe he lacks. By virtue of the screed that he sat here and gave us, his views still are disqualifying for me, but his character and fitness ought to be a reason for everyone to vote no.